Hey guys, I hope you're ready to learn. This is AG watching Math to the Max, and today's topic is on solving system of equations using Desmos. All right, let's check out some vocabulary. Slope, known as rise over run, which measures the steepness of a line. So you remember riding a bike? You want to ride the bike down the steepest hill so you can get a fast pace on the bike. Y-intercept, the point in which you cross the y-axis. Slope, intercept, y equals mx plus b, m is the slope, b is the y-intercept. Some prior knowledge that will help us is knowing the slope intercept form y equals mx plus b we should have learned how to graph a line you can check that out in another video that i did um, you plot the y intercept and then you just move up that rise over run from that next point and then you connect the dots and you have your line make sure you draw your arrow on the end of the lines to show that it's continuous in both directions Ooh, we almost there. All right. So to graph in Desmos, you're going to just type each equation on the line. I'm going to show you. And then you're going to observe the graph to see which one applies in this chart. Okay, let's look at the chart. If the graphs cross, it's going to be one solution, a coordinate point. If the graphs are parallel, no solution. And if you see one line is going to be infinitely many solutions. All right, it's time to get some reps in. Let's get to it. Pause the video so you can write the questions down. Okay, this is number one. I'm going to type in both of the equations, one on each line. Now, you can either use your keyboard on your actual computer or you can use the keyboard in Desmos. Your choice. As you see the graph cross and I'm using the plus and minus sign to zoom in and out it's on your top right and I just click the point and it's going to tell me the coordinate point so that's our solution 1 negative 5 all right let's move on to problem number two Now, both lines are graphed. Does it cross? Do you see two lines? No, I only see one line. So that means it's going to be infinitely many solutions. All right, and our last problem, let's get it. All right, the lines are parallel because they never cross, so it is no solution. The good news is this is an Algebra 1 lesson, and you have access to Desmos on the Georgia Milestones for the Algebra 1 test. Always striving for excellence and reaching for success.